All right, let's try to get in one more video before I head off here. So we just met Sarah. If um, you didn't watch the video before this, uh, what can be said about Sarah? Uh, well, she's definitely a character. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing. It seems that meeting new companions is all that there is to this, this these last two videos. So let's continue. Let's go to the the Geese Lane Estate. Hopefully, we can get something done. <laughs> I can't. I can't believe that. Oh my God. Rage demons are weak to cold damage. Oh, good to know. And I'm close to leveling up myself, which is perfect. What do we have here? Lord Trevelyan of Ostwick. Representing the Inquisition. A pleasure, sir. We so rarely have a chance to meet anyone new. It is always the same crowd at these parties. So you must be a guest of Madame de Fer. Or are you here for Duke Bastien? Are you here on business? I have heard the most curious tales of you. I cannot imagine half of them are true. <laughs> What have you heard about me? Some say that when the veil opened, Andraste herself delivered you from the fate. Yeah, that's about true. No hey. I'm not familiar with that name. I was invited here by First Enchanter Vivienne. Madame de Fer is a fond nickname the court has given Lady Vivienne. I've heard she finds it amusing. I don't know what that means. I've heard very little about Duke Bastien. He hasn't been seen much at court lately. His business with the Council of Heralds often takes him from home for long periods. It can't be good for a man of his years. And of course, there's the civil war. Bastien probably wishes to distance himself from the actions of his one-time son-in-law. Tearing up the Dales in a foolish bid for power? It will end in disgrace for Gaspar. Everyone knows it. Hmm. Some of those storytellers may have gotten carried away. But only for the best effect. The Inquisition is a ripe subject for wild tales. The Inquisition. What a lot of pig shit. Washed up sisters and crazed seekers. No one can take them seriously. Want me to punch you, you in the fucking throat? It's just an excuse for a bunch of political outcasts to grab power. Hmm. The Inquisition is working to restore peace and order to Thetis. Here comes the outsider, restoring peace with an army. We know what your Inquisition truly is. If you were a man of honor, you'd step outside and answer the charges. What? Charges for my dear Marquis. How unkind of you to use such language in my house to my guests. Okay, that must be yes, Madame de Fer. This is intolerable. Uh, Madame Vivienne, I humbly beg your pardon. You should. Whatever am I going to do with you, my dear? My lord, you're the wounded party in this unfortunate affair. What would you have me do with this foolish, foolish man? He's an asshole, but... Uh, he, do uh, he doesn't deserve to die for it. I just wanted to punch him in the throat, that's all. I think the Marquis has seen the error of his ways. By the grace of Andraste, you have your life, my dear. Do be more careful with it. 
I'm delighted you could attend this little gathering. I've so wanted to meet you. Okay. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Vivienne, first enchanter of Montsimard and enchantress to the Imperial Court. What about the Marquis? Is that Marquis going to pose a problem? His aunt is the Vicomtesse of Mont de Glace. Not a powerful family, but well respected and very devout. Alphonse will be disowned for this. It's not the first time he's brought his aunt disgrace, but I'm sure it'll be the last. And after such a public humiliation, I expect he'll run off to the Dales to join the Empress's war effort. Either to make a good end or to win back a modicum of self-respect. Well, you know what? Pleasure to meet you. Charmed, Lady Vivian. Ah, but I didn't invite you to the Chateau for pleasantries. With Divine Justinia dead, the Chantry's in shambles. Only the Inquisition might restore sanity and order to our frightened people. As the leader of the last loyal mages of Thedas, I feel it only right that I lend my assistance to your cause. <laughs> I'm a mage, so I mean... Sorry, no I'm kidding. <laughs> Is this business or pleasure? You say you led the last of the loyal mages. Loyal to whom? To the people of Thedas, of course. We have not forgotten the commandment, as some have, that magic exists to serve man. I support any effort to restore such order. So you're in favor of returning the mages to the circle, then? Where else can mages safely learn to master their talents? We need an institution to protect and nurture magic. Maker knows. Magic will find neither on its own. Hmm. Are you devout? What's your opinion of the Chantry? I was a great admirer of the late divine Justinia V. The Chantry, at its best, unites the disparate cultures of Thedas and looks after its most vulnerable. Had she lived, Justinia could have accomplished so much. I tell you, these Orlesians have some crazy fashion senses, man. This stuff is just nuts. It's so bizarre. What's in this for you? The same thing anyone gets by fighting this chaos. The chance to meet my enemy, to decide my fate. I won't wait quietly for destruction. What exactly can you do for the Inquisition? I am well versed in the politics of the Orlesian Empire. I know every member of the Imperial Court personally. Whoa. I have all the resources remaining to the Circle at my disposal. And I'm a mage of no small talent. Will that do? Y yeah, that, uh, <laughs> that will do just fine. <laughs> the Inquisition will be happy to have you, Lady Vivian. Great things are beginning, my dear. I can promise you that. So, oh, there you have it. Two, two new followers in a span of two videos. That's crazy. Um, they got a wide variety of different, um, different personalities, and it's it's sweet. I like it. You know. Different people are going to like different companions better. But, I mean, I don't know how often I'll be using certain characters. Because, I mean, if I'm a mage, I need things to complement, you know, my character. So, I'm not going to have a team of three mages. So, Solace and Vivienne, I'll use them, but not so much. They might have to sacrifice... Let me get rid of this thing. It might have to sacrifice, you know, having a rogue in my party or something of the matter, you know? I always need warriors. Always. So they automatically took us back to Haven. Let me see something. Let's see this armor. I'm t I better be able to wear this shit. Where? Before I beat someone up. Wait, why did it take so long to show? 
Damn. Let me make it. Oh, restriction mage only, so it tells you. Rogue. So all you have to do is click on it and it tells you. I kind of forgot all that, to be honest. Okay, so let's make a rogue. Uh, so this is armor, defense, defense. You see, I kind of forgot what they do already. I don't know. Damn, that red looks nice. But I clearly don't have enough. So this is armor. Okay, let me see the other colors first. What changes? What does this change? It changes the bottom, but not by much. So I want one melee defense. So we'll take iron. To oh, that changes the, the color of the thing completely. Nice. One range damage. Oh man. Oh, you see, that sucks. They all have... They're just... Elemental resistances. What the fuck? Oh, that sucks, dude. I didn't go hunting for... Thing, either. I want range at Range resistance. Okay, well, if anything, I can just always, I can always come back and just do this after. <laughs> yeah, all changes will be lost. Let's see the enchanter male legs. Defense, defense. Oh, so I can have it on either one, huh? Okay, so how about I... Build the jacket for more defense for myself. Shit, what did I have here? Was it silk? I can't remember. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know anymore. I think it was. No, it probably wasn't for all I know. I had iron. Damn, I like that. Let me see. Just customize my guy. I like this. I like this feature a lot, to be honest. Okay. All right. This video is gonna come to an end soon. I think we'll do this. No. Fuck it. We'll go white. Yeah, this video is about to come to an end. Thank you for watching, guys. Um, we got a lot done in this few moments. But if anything, stay tuned for more videos tomorrow. And let me know if you want to see anything else. Crafting. There we go. Nice.